Let's talk tremors. Tremors are involuntary rhythmic oscillations or movements of part of a body, usually your hand, but it can be other parts of the body as well. There's three main types and one additional one we'll talk about. You've got rest tremors, you've got postural tremors, you've got intention tremors, and you've got your benign essential tremor, which we'll come on to in a second. Let's start with rest tremor. Rest tremors are slow, frequency, low frequency, typically worse with rest as it suggests and eases with activities. Think about Parkinson's disease, things like your pill rolling tremor as a good example. Then you have postural tremors. These are worse with posture. So if you put your hand out, for example, you may get a very fine tremor, an example of a postural tremor. Things like medication, salbutamol, for example, things like hyperthyroidism, things like hepatic encephalopathy. There's lots of different reasons why you might get a postural tremor. Then the third one down here is intention tremor, worse with intention. So worse with voluntary movements when you're intending to do something like finger to nose, for example. Think about cerebellar things here, but lots of things can cause cerebellar problems and they in turn can lead to intention tremor. And then you have this benign essential or essential tremor, often known as familial tremor. It's an example of a postural tremor, but we don't know why it happens. There's thought to be some genetic component, but it's not fully understood. It tends to happen worse as you get older. You tend to refer these to neurologists to rule out other causes of tremor. Lots of treatments, but beta blockers tend to be one of the first line things that are tried. So three main types of tremor. Rest tremor worse with rest. Postural tremor worse with posture. Intention tremor worse with intention. Hope this helps.